Blodgett BCT controller. It's our Blodgett Combi Touch Android controller. And this is the main menu. You've got your recipes that you can use from your file, 500 of them. Favorites, the ones that you use every day. And then manual, when you want to cook manually, and your advanced um, selections for USB and things like that. And I'll show you that in a minute. But let's go into manual. You select the manual and you have all these cooking options. Hot air, convection oven, Combi Smart, steaming low temperature steaming to high temperature steaming, retherm mode, combi optima with the percentage of humidity, advanced settings, your combi smart allows anybody with any skill level to cook, your recipes and then your favorite items that you can recall at a moment, and then you have your combi wash cycle which will choose what level of cleaning you want, hit start and it'll clean the oven for you. Now, what's the difference between combi smart and combi optima? You can see the percentage symbol. The Combi Optima measures and controls and regulates the humidity for you. Combi Smart allows the chef to cook exactly the way that he wants, okay? Then we also have Smart Chef. If I activate Smart Chef, you can choose between the menu items that you'd like to cook. If I select B, for example, and I would like to do it breaded, I can select between where, rare excuse me, and well done, thick or thin, and then just press start. It's that simple. Now I want to show you that if you select something like the mode hot air, you set the temperature that you want. I'm going to set it for 300, okay, just by scrolling down. The timer, I'll set it for maybe one minute or two minutes. There we go. And then it automatically sets itself and starts running. Okay, back to the hot air mode. What I want to show you that on the fly, um, you can actually do continuous cooking by just pushing the continuous cooking rack. You can also adjust the fan speed, even on the fly. If I want to go 50% fan speed, I just scroll down to 50, press OK, and now it's 50%. This little button right here, this allows me to open or close the vent to release humidity or close it, and then I have a steam injection or steam on demand button. I can push this button and steam for 10 seconds, nine seconds, five seconds, put OK and it will automatically count down as it's spraying in for you. Or you could just press and hold it. So, want to come back to the hot air mode, we set the temperature, we set the time, and now we also have a rack timer that I want to show you. In this case, I want to set it for five racks and one timer for each shelf. And then I hit the little icon up here, the yellow arrow, and I can activate those shelf timers. I'm going to set it for five minutes, that's fine starts counting down immediately so I can load two shelves get that going and then if you have other items even if they're different items but they all cook at the same temperature we can load them and keep track of all five menu items the rack timing is really um, a great way for a la carte cooking and now it's it's that easy we can keep track of all five items Blodgett's BC Touch is one of the world's first Android controllers and as you can see it couldn't be any easier to operate. 